Hello kings, queens, nerds, and geeks, Powder Milk here, and welcome back to Doki Doki Literature Club. Now guys, as of last episode, everything became extremely fucked up! But, um, again, I'm teamed up with my wife here, because we're recording, like, right after this. And, um, well, no, not right right after, but sometime after. Yeah. We're all covered in blankets. Also, guys, do you like the blanket my wife got me? It's so soft. Anyway, as you can see, Siori is no longer in the picture, and that fucking depresses me. And now we're gonna get right back into it. We were, um, doing poetry with everybody else. So we already talked to, uh, Natsuki, now we're going to Yuri. Which, every time I read her name, I always think of lesbian hentai, okay? You're about to say something. Say it. Yeah. Oh, I can see her face now. She's like, uh, I don't like this. I did go against her thing this time. Okay. Mm. Yeah. No, no, there's nothing changed yet. It's still highlighted. Hmm. She's still doing it. Yuri stares at the poem. A minute passes before enough time to finish the reading. Hmm. Oh, oh. So sorry. I forgot to, st I forgot to start speaking. Uh, um, it's fine. You don't force yourself. What? Uh huh. Well, we're about to find out. I'm telling you that now, so I may actually genuinely be shocked. Well, well, in my playthrough, just focusing on Yuri first, uh, Natsuki didn't do anything. She usually made made boyfriend references here and there, but that was it. Natsuki's not going to do anything. It's Yuri I'm worried about. Well, we're about to find out. That's fine, don't force yourself. I'm not. I... Huh? I actually like Yuri as a character. I actually like all three of those. Yeah, in a way. Let's see. Uh, you're you have the dark side. You have you have a dark side of depression. You have the uh, um, yandere version of her, huh? Yeah, but everybody has their moments. I just need to put my thoughts into words. Hold on. Okay. This is your first time writing a poem, right? Uh, yeah? Why do you ask? I'm just making sure. I'm guessing you might uh, be after reading this through, though. It's... Ah, it's... So it's that bad? No! Did you just raise my... Did I just raise my voice? Um, I'm so sorry. Yeah. But that's because I did choose a different path. Yuri, uh, buries her face in her hands. I couldn't help but notice that she's been several minutes and we really haven't gotten anywhere. It'll make it take time Yuri a while to get used to the new people. It's fine, I really didn't notice. What are you saying? Right, um, it's just that there are specific writing habits that are usually typical with new writers. I haven't been through them myself, I might learn to pick up on them. I think the most noticeable thing I recognize with new writers is that they try to make their style very deliberate. In other words, they tend to pick writing style separate from the topic matter, and then they form it to the two together. It ends up results in both a style with expressiveness and we express expressiveness and are weakened. Ah, can't read right. I just realized my camera's right here for some reason. Oh, let me move that. Hold on. Because I like it off the thing, so I can see everything. It might be blocking something that I'd be missing. Yuria finds her train of thought as if her demeanor totally changes. Her stammer is completely gone and she sounds like an expert. Of course, that's not something you can be blamed for. There's no, there are so many different skills and techniques to go into a writing, even a simple poem. 
Not just finding them and building them, but getting them to work together is probably the most challenging part. It'll take you some time, but it'll, it all comes with practice and learning it by example and trying new things. I also hope that everyone else in this club gives you a valuable feedback. Natsuki can be a little bit biased, though. Biased how? Um, well, never mind. I shouldn't be talking about people like that. Sorry. It's fine. I'm not sure if Yuri's apologizing herself to me or, or to Natsuki. Do you mind if I read your poem now? Please, do. I love to share my thought process behind it. Her Yuri smiles dreamily as if that's a rare opportunity for her. Which itself is kind of funny. After all, it is supposed to be a literature club. Okay. Ghost, the trendles of my hair illuminate beneath the amber glow. Bathing, it must be one. The last remaining streetlight has restored time. At last, replaced the sickening blue green hue of the future. The bathe calms breathing air in the present of the living past. The light thickens. I kick. I. I... It says. The light flickers. Hmm. I was trying to read it because I can, couldn't read it for a minute. Not that well, no. I could write my name in cursive. Not that well! Does it mean I could read it that well? You're left handed because it is typically left. Typically, left-handed people are more apt at cursive, like reading it and or writing it. Boz, uh, sorry, not Boz, uh, Jacob, for example, he's terrible at writing print, but he's excellent at writing cursive. Well, you can read... writing is terrible no matter what. Well, you could read cursive. Well... Well, you could read cursive, can't you? Yes. That's I said and or. It doesn't have to be both. So. I write really fast. So. But yeah, that's what I was saying. So I'm gonna guess she's really left. I'm gonna guess she's left-handed. Just to be off topic. Yeah. But this is basically the same poem from last time. I'm sorry if I have such terrible handwriting. What? Well, <laughs> I was supposed to think of that at all. But it took a lo long time to read. Uh, well, as I don't read script very often. And I actually th think your handwriting is pretty. Oh my god, I never even noticed that before. That is kind of what you just said. What? Like, the character in the game is kind of like... It was kind of like what you had just said to me. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, eh, that's a relief. Also, I like the poem. Even though it's sh it's short, it's really descriptive. It wasn't too short. I usually write longer poems. Not at all. Yeah, I'm really glad you liked it. To be, I'll be honest. Since this is, okay, this is all the same shit before. Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. Make sure I'm skimming over it, see if I see any changes. Okay, nothing's changed. And now Monica. High powdered milk. Having a good time so far? Uh, yeah. Good, glad to hear it. By the way... Maybe because it's your playthrough that was different. Make sure you check here too. Well, he might have done something different too. Remember, I. By the way, since you're new and everything, if you ever have any suggestions for the club, like new activities or things that we could do better, I'm always listening. Don't be afraid to bring things up, okay? All right, I'll keep that in mind. Of course, I'm afraid to bring this up. Things up. I'm, I'm I'm much better off to go with the flow and just settle in. Go with the flow, huh? Go with the flow, huh? Anyway, I want to share a poem with me. It's kind of embarrassing, but I guess I have to. 
Don't worry, Powder Milk. We're all a little embarrassed today, you know. I'm more terrified right now. But it's that sort of barrier that we all learn to get past soon. Oh, well, yeah, if you noticed, I was talking to Diego about the game. Yeah, I was telling Diego about the game. I was telling him he needs to continue because he lost interest in the game. Why? He just did. Yeah, there's hidden things all over it. Yeah, I told I'll him that. You, I'll show you later some more of the hidden things that you need in those places. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. I had Monica, uh, I hand Monica my poem. Hmm. I like it, Powder Milk. Really? It's a lot cuter than I expected. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, no, no. Uh, it kind of makes me think of something that Suki would write. But she, and she's a good writer, too. So, take that out as a compliment. <laughs> if you say so. Yep. If you're, if you're interested in Natsuki, then always keep a, a, a snack on you. She'll cling to you like a puppy. Maybe that's a thing. Did she ever say that to you? Natsuki about food. Yeah. Okay, then maybe I'm just wrong about that. <laughs> maybe. Yeah. Now Natsuki's dad doesn't give her much l her lunch money and leave her any food in the house, so she's a fussy mood pretty e often. But sometimes she just loses all her strength and shuts down. Like earlier. Yeah, yeah you say that's losing strength and shutting down. Her eyes went missing. Yeah. Mm. Huh. But th this is just a guess, but I think she's a small... Uh, she's small because her mal mal malnutrition is interfering with her adolescent growth. But hey, some guys are a little are into petite girls too, you know. I'm not petite, I'm fat. You're still short. Shut up. I love you. I love you. <laughs> what? Sorry, I was just trying to look at the bright side. Haha, <laughs> do you n want to read my poem now? Don't worry, it's not very good. You sound uh, it's pretty. You sound pretty confident for someone who claims it's not very good. Well, well, that's because I ha have to sound confident. That doesn't mean I, I feel that way, you know? I see. Well, let's read it then. Hole in the wall. I think I've heard this one before. Yeah, I might be saying a message. Yeah, the punctuation. Yeah. B C I B A A O. Maybe it's. It doesn't spell anything. But. Trying to find messages in it, but you can't find anything. Like, make something once you get all of the words. Like, all the letters down. Like, you want to find, like, the sentence. Like, 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 But. A hole in the wall. But he wasn't looking at me. Confused, I frankly glance at my surroundings. But the burnt eyes can no longer see color. Are there any, any others in the room? Are they talking? Or are they simply poems on a flat sheet of paper? The sound of frantic scrawling, playing tricks in my ears, the room begins to crinkle. Close my eyes, the air I breathe dissipates before I reach my lungs. I panic. There must be a way out. It's right there. He's... He's right there. I swallow my fears. I banish my. I brandish my pan. <clears throat> Is he trying to like say she's trying to impress me? Hmm. So what do you think? Hmm. It's very free free form. But hold on. We're not there yet. Free form. It's not that I could call it. It might be just my game, and it may be different for everybody who plays. You okay? You worried? Are you worried? No. Is this something? Hmm? 
Oh, oh, I see the problem. You're looking at my leg. I, I'm sorry. Just say it, or else I won't get it. I'm completely stupid, remember? <laughs> oh well. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not really, uh... Oh yeah, guys, if you recognize this cup anywhere, you're probably in the military. Sorry, I'm not really uh, the right person to ask for feedback. Huh, it's okay. Yeah, the kind of style I've gotten pretty popular nowadays. That is, a lot of poems are being put emphasis on timing between words and lines. But performing out loud, it can be really powerful. That was the uh, inspiration behind this one. What was the inspiration behind this one, I mean? Uh, well, I'm not sure if I know how to put it. I guess I could say I had some kind of empathy, uh, epiphany recently. I'm being influenced by this poem a bit. This is all the same shit, really. I'm, I'm just going to skip through it until I find something different. Here's the Monica tip of the day. I want to read this. Sometimes when you're writing a poem or a story, your brain can get fixated on a specific point. You try hard so hard to get, make that por uh, perfect, then you'll be making make uh any you, yeah. Then you'll never make any progress. Just for just force yourself to get something down on the paper and tidy it up later. Another way to think about it is this. If you keep your pen in the same spot for too long, you'll just get a, a bit a dark puddle of ink. So just move your hand and go with the flow. That's my advice for today. Thanks for listening. Yeah, it's the same shit. Pew, I guess that's everyone. I glance around. There's nothing changed. And there's nothing here I can see. I wonder what the text on me copyright means. I wonder, I, I don't know what that is. Yeah. She's pretty good judge of the mediocre writing abilities. And then... This is what I sigh. I guess that's why I end up in my first two. Across the room, Monica writing something on her notebook. Eyes land on Yuri and Natsuki. I bet that... They're gingerly exchanging sheets of paper, staring at you. Oh boy. You were warning about this earlier. We're only 17 minutes in the video. From the uh, hanging. From dead. <sighs> Natsuki's eyebrows furrow in frustration. While well, Yuri smiles sadly. What's with what this language? Uh, did you say something? There's nothing. Uh, Natsuki just really returns the poem to the desk on her hand. I guess you could say it's fancy. Uh, thanks. Yours is cute. Cute? Did you completely miss the symbolism or, or something? It's clearly out of feeling of giving up. How can you be cute? I know that. I just meant language, I guess. I was trying to say something nice. Uh, you mean you have to try hard to come up with something nice to say? Thanks, but it really didn't come out nice at all. Um, well, I have a couple suggestions. Hmm? I was looking for suggestions I would have asked someone who actually liked it. Which people did. But, by the way, Monica liked it, and Powder Milk did too. So, based on that, I gladly give your suggestions of my own. First of all, excuse me, I appreciate the offer, but I spent a long time establishing my writing style. I don't expect- okay, this is all the same shit. I haven't yet- it changes. Um, I remember if you like my poem too, you know. I mean, totally was impressed by it. Natsuki suddenly stands up. Oh, I didn't realize you two were so invested in trying to impress our new member, Yuri. Okay, this is all- yeah, that's not what I... Uh, hmm. Maybe you're just jealous that Power Milk appreciates my advice more than you appreciate yours. Huh, how do you know that he didn't appreciate my advice more? Uh... I know... I wasn't... If I was full of myself, I would deliberately go out of my way and make everything I do overly cutesy. Uh, well, you know what? I wasn't the one whose boobs magically grew with a size bigger... At or as soon as Powder Milk starts showing up. She implies she's stuffing her bra, that's what I'm asking. Yeah, Not Suki. We're wearing a push up. Hmm. Yeah. Well, I'm happy with yours. I'm happy with yours. Huh? 
Yeah, double, they're almost double Ds, aren't they? Um, Natsuki, that's a little... It doesn't involve you. Okay, talking about your insecurities like others like that, you really act like young as you look, Natsuki. Me? Look who's talking... It keeps speeding up! Yeah, Which edgy? I'm sorry, that was uh, the mental age of the comprehending C. And I was just trying to prove my point. And just check that. Just say in the proof. Most people. Oh well! Most people learn to get over themselves after they graduate middle school, you know. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> need to stop harassing others with a sickening attitude. Cute. Oh, the only thing. Uh, Yuri. Uh, oh my god, you already do, don't you? Did you just accuse me of cutting myself? What the fuck is wrong with your head? Yeah, go on. Hey, let Kyra hear everything you really think. I'm sure he'll be head over heels after this. Uh -huh. Suddenly, Yuri turns towards me and she notices I was standing there. Powder milk. She's trying to make me look bad. That's not true. She started it. Uh, uh, what? What? I didn't even get to read all that! What? Um, hey, Powder Milk. Why don't we step outside for a bit? Okay. Sorry about that. What the fuck just happened? Sorry about that. Uh, I really shouldn't have tried to get you involved. It's probably better for us to stay out of this. We'll go back inside whenever, when they're done yelling. <laughs> Some present I am, right? I can't even confront my own club members properly. I just wish I was able to be a little more a assertive sometimes. But I never ha have an enemy to put my foot down against others. You understand, right? Anyway, if it makes you want to spend less time with the others, then that's fine. I'll be happy to spend time with you instead. Suddenly, Natsuki runs out of the classroom. She quickly runs away. Oh, dear. Well, it looks like they're done. I didn't, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. Yuri is rocking back and forth in her Oh my god, the background changed! That's the change! OH MY GOD! That's what I was trying to warn you about. Why is she hanging hung herself in the back? Why is that picture there? Remember, she's supposed to be deleted right now. No, she's still deleted, Derek. I'm checking. No, no, I'm checking the thing here. What the fuck is this? What is wrong with this game? Yuri is rocking back and forth uh, palms in her forehead. Yuri? I didn't mean it. Everyone's freaking out. Okay, I think this is... Okay, you, one thing you should also pay attention to is Yuri's face. Okay? Uh-huh. Not right now. Yeah, I pay attention a lot to her face a lot. Right now, she's like... Yeah, I, I believe you. I have no idea what Yuri might have said to Natsuki. Or did. Powder milk, please don't hate me, please. I, I'm not I like this. There's something wrong with me today. It's fine, Yuri. We know. Oh, you didn't mean it. Besides, I'm sure Natsuki will forget about it by tomorrow, completely. Don't tell me. She's gonna delete us. No. Anyway, the meeting is over. You can and come home now if you want. Uh, Yuri looks at me like she wants to say something, but she keeps glancing at Monica. You can go first, Monica. I'd like to stay a little bit longer. I'm the president, so I should be the last one out. I'll we wait for you. I'll wait for you to be done. Well, I'm vice president, so please let me take this responsibility today. I'm kind of sounds like you don't want me around or something, Yuri. It's not that. 
It's not that. I just... I didn't... I didn't get much of a chance to discuss my book with powder milk. It would be such an embarrassment if with you listening. <sighs> I guess I don't really have a choice, do I? I'm sorry for causing trouble. But I really appreciate your... I didn't click anything! She forced that! Now, let's keep doing the cute stuff. Pink. Lollipop. Sugar. I got tagged in something. Kitty! Sorry guys, if you heard that, sorry, the, the, the computer just played Pinkie Pie style all of a sudden. Bounce, bounce, bouncy. How about poop? Vanilla. Uh, rose. Oh! Oops, oh well. Um, kiss. Childhood. Mouse. Rainbow. Ha. Got five more to go. Um, six or five, I think. Uh, charm. Uh, not that one. Cause I know who likes that one. Uh, nibble. I don't know. Should, should I click it? I don't know. I've never seen that in a thing before. You want me to click it? Uh, go ahead. I've never seen it. What's happening? Okay, I've never had this happen before. Click dokey dokey. Is it trying to push you to Yuri? Or is this making Yuri break faster? This could be a monitor. I've, I've never had this problem before. I've never had this experience before. Me neither. Strawberry? Candy? Candy! What's happening? Although they paid past it, but it's time for the club meeting already. I don't know what just happened, but that was cool. I've never seen that. that was kind of cool, I'll be honest, though. That is some good, excellent game making. Uh, time for the club meeting already. I a couple days. i in the classroom as usual, seeing greets me. Uh, hi, Yuri. Not sure if it's me or it's Yuri's expression. Girl still hangs up here in the air a little. Um, uh, over my shoulder looking around the room. Matsuki is re-logged at her desk. And surprising Monaka isn't here yet. Look! There's a new one! There is? Yeah! Aha! Uh -huh. It's a good thing we clicked it. I can't do anything. Nothing. No matter how many times that you play, it's it's all the same. It'll be, it would be really really easy to kill kill myself right now. But I would mean I, I don't get to talk to you anymore. All I want for you is to hate hate them. Why is it so that's so hard? Yeah. The I've heard this one before, but I never had that other experience. Hold on. Let me, uh, guys. I'm gonna put this one. Uh, Wait, okay, here's my stuff. Sorry guys, my computer's slow. I want to keep these as trophies. I don't know either. Yeah. The corner of the room. Yuri uh, takes my arm and pulls me to the corner of the room. About yesterday. I... I really need to apologize. Uh, nothing like the that has ever happened before, and something it just came over me, I guess. I wasn't acting mentally sound. Please don't, uh, think you're usually like this. Not to just me, but Natsuki as well. Yuri? I'm happy that you're considering and apologize. You don't have to worry so much. Even though I'm th I'm here for a couple- I've only been here a couple days, I could tell that something was uh, off yesterday. Maybe you were just a little extra sensitive because it was our first time sharing homes. But whatever it was, I didn't make me uh, think of any less of you. Did it switch me? 
Because I have a feeling it switched me to Yuri. I don't know. Uh, a bad... I uh, can be a bad person. I know that you're apologizing, but I know you didn't mean it. Uh, powder milk? Don't say those kinds of things so frankly. They make me a little too happy. You're really glad that you're such an understanding person, and I'm really glad you joined this club. Everything's a little br bit brighter with you around, and... Uh, sorry, what did I say just... Hey, come back! Say right now. Yuri's face. Uh, hold on, I'm trying to change something over here. I'm making sure I'm highlighting everything so we know if anything's new. I just... Hey, have you guys seen Monica? Uh, no I haven't. I was chill- uh, I was also kind of wondering where she was. Man. Yuri, I get- I'm guessing you haven't either. Uh... Yuri is clearly taken aback by how uh, calmly Natsuki is addressing her. No, no, I haven't. Jeez, this isn't like her at all. I know it's stupid, but I can't help but worry a little bit. Is this new? For you? No. Okay. Hmm. What? Why are you looking at me like that? Um... Natsuki, about yesterday. I just wanted to apologize. I promise I didn't mean any of the things I said. And I'll do my best to s stay under control from now on. So... Yuri, what the heck are you talking about? Did you do something in yesterday? She really did forget! Completely! Eh... Jeez. Whatever's on your mind, I'm sure it was nothing. Uh, I don't even remember anything bad happening. Why is this game so fucked? You're the- You're the kind of person who worries too much about the little things, aren't you? But, but... I accept your apology anyway if it helps you feel any better about it. Besides, it's kind of nice to hear, since uh, I'm always afraid you secretly hated me or something like that. <laughs> no, not at all. I don't hate you. <laughs> well, you're kind of weird, but I don't hate you either. Mm -hmm. That's if he turns to me. You're still on trial, though. Hey? Okay? Suddenly, the door swings open. Sorry, I'm super sorry. Um, there you are. I didn't mean to be late. I hope you guys weren't worried at all, or I'll, I, or anything. Nah. Well, Natsuki was. I was not. <laughs> what? Took you so long, anyway. Uh. Well, my last period today was study hall. To be honest, I kind of just lost track of time. Blah blah blah. That's normal stuff. Mm-hmm. At least I heard of it. It's practicing piano. Piano. I wasn't aware of anything. Mm -hmm. That fucking stance. That fucking stance. Don't you hate that stance? I don't understand why she's always in that stance where she's all like, Ugh. She's like she's trying to push her boobs out. Oh, thank you, Yuri. Or But hey, do you know anything about the songs she's talking about writing? Yeah. Okay, I figured there was something leading to that. In that case, I won't let you down, Powder Milk. Monica smiles sweetly. Uh, is something... I didn't mean to pressure you or anything like that, but sorry. Hopefully we can share it with you anyway. Uh, I see. Monica's referring to the whole club or just me. Hmm? Not really... I think he's already our milk. Um, since your compliment put me in a good mood, I was wondering if you would like to spend time with, together with me. I was about to go to Natsuki and she popped up. I suppose so. I don't think I can say no to you after you gave me the book after all. Mm. 
No, she's po No, she's forcing it. She's like, she's fine. She's reading over there, see? Don't think about her so much. I think I glitched her. She's used to being ignored. Come over here and go over here or there. It kind of glitched. Yeah, they're bugging the shit out of me. What's the story about anyway? Well, hmm. I took her on the cover. The book is called Portrait of the Marco. I'm just looking eye symbol on the cover. The eye symbol is making me more. The religious camp turned into a human experiment prison. Human experiment prison? Uh, trapped to have traits turns into the killing machine for the lust of blood. What? Sorry, I can't control it. Guys, my leg is shaking and it really bugs my wife. And I can't control it. Huh? No, it's fine. Uh, it's fine. Uh, but it still bugs her and she knows this. But we have. But I'm trying to control it. I'm trying my hardest not to do it. So, I'm sorry. Anyway, and, and the people trapped there have to this trait that turns them into killing machines for the lust of blood. Yeah, my mom had the same problem. Uh, but the Felicity, uh... Yeah, but the facility gets even worse, and they start selectively breeding people by cutting off their limbs and affixing them to... Oh, that might be a little bit of a spoiler. Anyway, I'm really into it. I think that was different from before. Because I don't remember that. The book, I mean. Nothing... Not that the thing, that, thing about the limbs. That's kind of... That's kind of dark, isn't it? You already made it sound like it was going to be a nice story, but... So that, so that dark turned out... D turn came in from nowhere. Uh... You're not a fan of short, or, uh, sh that sort of reading powder milk. No, it's not that. I mean, I can definitely enjoy those kinds of stories, so don't worry. I hope so. Yeah, I don't... I totally forget that Yuri's into those things. She's probably shy and reclusive. Same shit. I think she kind of went more further into the story background than before. Because when I went through before, she didn't tell me about the story as much. But, I think she went more into it by spoiling it a little bit. You okay? Okay, horrible thing you can want to be. But because in the world's full of horrible people and we're all worthless anyway. Then suddenly... I'm rambling, aren't I? Not again. Sorry. Don't, don't apologize, blah blah blah. Well, I guess that's right then. I guess it's your problems. Person thinks you're for my thoughts. My home. Oh my! I couldn't read that. I. <sighs> Maybe I'll go back and find out what it says. Uh, I just kind of forget to pay attention to other people. I'm sorry if I end up saying something strange. And please stop me if I start talking too much. That's. I really don't think you you need to worry. It just means you're passionate about reading. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, uh, that's. Well, that's true. In fact. Yes, I mean, but saying, uh, get the book, I quickly retrieve the book and put it in the bag. Alright, it's fine, I sit there, right? I set the seat next to Yuri's. Uh, yeah, are you sure? You seem really apprehensive, that's, I'm sorry. It's not that I don't want to, it's something I'm very really used to. Reading in company with someone, I see. Well, let's just tell me if you end up distracting you or anything. Alright. I open the book and start to prologue. He's reading the company. I feel her presence on my shoulder as I read. It's not a particularly bad thing. Maybe a little distracting, but I feel somewhat comforting. In the eye. Really, she's not actually looking at her own. I glance at her. She's reading the book instead. So sorry. I was just. She was bathing in something. That's what I read so far. Uh, I really. I really apologize. Don't. You don't really need to apologize, I do. I don't really meant to, I'm sorry. I mean, uh huh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm 
back to this. You said look at her face, right? Uh, well, mm, hmm. I know I'm very skeptical though. Do the same thing right now on the right side of the book. Lay a page, you resize with your thumb under, push your side. <laughs> yeah, you know, I like how you only get one glance of my own hand. Uh, nibbles under the. Huh. Humbled closer. To... Is it like a generic stand? Generic character? Hmm. Actually, kind of distracting me. Uh, my vision. Oh, she's staring at me now. Are you ready? Yeah. To turn the page. Oh, sorry. I think I was getting a bit distracted for a second. Glanced over Yuri's face again, and the eyes met. I don't know what I'd be able to keep up with her. Uh, that's okay. Not used to reading, right? I don't want. I'm being patient. It takes you a bit longer. This is all the same shit. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, though, but the main character just kind of reminds me of a little bit of. <laughs> her eyes just chip. Yeah. Yeah, her face changed, because that wasn't happening the first time I did that. No, no, I don't relate to this character at all. Definitely not. Real really? I was just thinking of the way you second-guess things. Her eyes. She's, she's very nervous. What are you talking about? Sorry. Something else about her. Something else. N n never mind. She's skeptical. Oh, she is a suit. She is a yandere. That or she's really fucking depressed. Mm-hmm. Came out of my head. Uh, if you're, uh, feeling alright, uh, Yuri seems to be a little fidgety ever since I started reading. You can, re you can rest if you're feeling sick or something. Uh, your breathing is a little... My breathing? She puts her hands on her chest and feels her heartbeat. I didn't even notice. Anyway, I'm fine. I just need eat some water. Alright, don't push yourself. Yuri stands up and practically rushes out the classroom. What on earth is that about? Powder milk? Did something happen just now? Uh, I have no idea. Yuri's just acting a little strange, I guess. So, you don't know anything. Sorry, I can't say I do. Are you worried about her? Oh no, not really. I was just making sure that you didn't do anything to her. No, no, nothing. Uh -huh, don't worry, I believe you, silly. Yuri is just does this sometimes, so it's nothing alarming. Alright, if you say so, I don't think you're telling the truth right now. Anyway, why don't you start with sharing your poems with each other? Eh? Shouldn't we wait for Yuri? Well, she might be a while, so I figured you'll be get started without her. Is that okay? Yeah, I'm just asking. I stand up. I make a mental note of where I left in my book, and then slip it back in the book. Monica's first? Yeah. Okay. That means Yuri's not an option. Hmm. So, Monica and Atsuki, what do you want me to choose first? Monica? Yes. Okay. Hi, I'm Powder Milk again. How's your writing going? Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, it's bad. Applying yourself for the masterpiece. I counted that. Nigga, no. Great job, Powder Milk. You're... It... I was going oh in my head while reading it. It was a. Um... It was a minute. It was really metaphorical, I'm not sure why. Something deep. Any easy way to take some low, the way it counts for some efforts. To be fair. Anyway. You know that Yuri likes this kind of right. It, it did change it! Wait, no, you were trying to go to Natsuki, but. It did change it! When I clicked it, it switched it! Why? It switched it! Oh god, it fucked with my gameplay! Ugh, spending so much time with that. Man, I like how we're almost in an hour already. Hmm. Mm. 
you get so happy. Mm -hmm. Relax you strongly. Mm. I'm back. And, um, uh, uh. Yeah, okay. Okay, this is different. Okay, yeah, they're missing letters now. Look, see, Save me. The colors they want. Bright, beautiful colors. Flashing up. Uh, expanding, piercing red, green, blue. An endless. Cacophony. I think that's supposed to mean something. Uh, of meaningless noise. Noise won't stop. Violent green. Spring. Yeah. Different Yeah, this one's very dark, like playing a knife on a breathing rib cage. Like this is all different, like It just glitched. And nothing changed over there. <gasps> the poster in the back's gone! The poster in the back's gone. It's kind of abstract. I'm just trying to, um... But never mind. There's no point of explaining. Anyway. Here's Monica's writing tip of the day. Sometimes you can find yourself facing a different decision. My phone's going off. Fuck. Hold on. Well, it's just Facebook. What happens if you say your game? You'll never know when, um... Who I'm talking to. Can you hear me? Tell me you can hear me. Anything? Please help me. Oh. This is Sarah. <gasps> By the way, in case you don't know. This is Sarah. Nothing's gonna change That's my advice for today. Thanks for listening. No, no, wait, that wasn't Sarah. That was Monica. Oh man, what She's the as a care, as the real person. Ah oh, shit. Yeah. 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 And there's nothing new so far. So. Last uh, one. This is saying that it's different from the last time. I'm spending some time with Yuri today. Uh, mm. Okay. Yeah, this game is forcing me to be with Yuri. In a way, yeah, it kind of made it to where it was... She's more, uh... Yeah. Yeah? I don't know how to do that, but I know it does that. Do you know what it says? No, I don't know how to do that. Well, we'll read the theory on that later. Oh god, I would want to find out what this is. Powdered milk. Why didn't you come eat with me today? I was waiting for you. I was waiting for a long time. It was the only thing I had to look forward to today. Why did you ruin it? Why, do you like Yuri more? I think you're more better off associating with her. You're listening to me. Yuri is a sick freak. I've never heard that should it. be obvious by now. The music just changed. Again? Yeah, just slightly. That could be more obvious by now. So just play with me instead. I don't know. Okay. I know. I see it. Don't you hate? You don't hate me, Powder Milk, do you? Do you hate me? Do you want to make me go home and crying? The club is the only place I feel safe. Don't ruin th that, that for me. She's bleeding! Oh my god! Don't ruin it, please! Just stop talking to Yuri. Play with me instead. It's all I have. I don't know. Play with me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Is play this an me. ending? I don't play with I, me. I, I've never... Her face! Look at it. Her smile. I've never had this experience before. <laughs> ah! Ah! Yeah, I just said end. Oh my god, what happened? I don't know. 
check her character files. I I've don't... never had that experience happen before. She's still there. She's, she's still, still there. there. Yeah, she's still there. Oh uh, my god. Okay, uh, nothing's changed though. More from what I saw. What, what's happening? I never... What, what was that all of a sudden? I don't know! It's been raining for this. Uh, uh, I should have went with her first to find before finding that out. I didn't know that was gonna happen. I don't know either. But it's a good thing I told you to click Monica. Remember, you would have clicked on Sayori, but I didn't tell you to choose Monica instead. Yeah. I don't know if it would have changed. Hmm. But yeah. Yeah. Um it's like the same form, it's just yeah. all scrunched together. Yeah. Yeah, it's just like trying to speed it up. Less scrolling. I don't know, but that freaked me the fuck out. I never saw that before. Ever. I've never had that happen before. Probably because I never played the Monica route. Yeah. I've only played this game like three times. Mm. Including the secret part, if you if you play it first. Mm-hmm. Doesn't really what it's about. Mine's a little hit. Hmm. Um. I it I just really like the way that it writes. I wrote this poem with it. She's talking and, about your pen. And now this you're touching it. Yeah. Uh -huh. I've had this it's, before. I'm okay. What did I just... Can we pretend this conversation never... She's going crazy. Can we? You can oh, keep this poem, though. Angry. Yeah. Th that's the same fucking thing. Another special poem. Oh. Happy thoughts. Ha I haven't gotten that either. It's Sayori. Oh my gosh. I never understood why the game keeps trying to remind you that Sayori was there. Yeah. I think I never really noticed when I played it. Yeah. And I never got that image before. Again, you, you unlock like different passages and stuff. For each play. Every time you play. Uh huh. Okay, everyone. That's why I didn't even know about the whole not to keep breaking her neck thing. Is she gone now, by the way? No, she's right no, there. She's right it was a it was a it was the game thing your, your eye was yeah sort of oh i kind of sort of festival the mm -hmm. well, yeah mm -hmm. i joined it hasn't said Creeper Ginger 2015 yet. It will. Because that was my old name. It will. Mm-hmm. It will. Uh -huh. Or it's supposed to at least. I haven't. No chance to find out, you know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, da da da. This game is really dark. Ugh. We'll work together. Let's do it as well. Get power milk, uh. Come on, you can't even have a problem with me, it's just because you just want to say anything. Look, Monica, do you really want us all to join the club with other people in mind? You just talked until Powder Milk... You already never even talked until Powder Milk joined. As for me, I just like it better than here than I do at home. And Powder Milk is even passionate about literature in the first place. And that's everyone. Sorry, you're really the only one here who's interested in finding new members. The rest of you here are fine like this. I know you're present and all, but you should really consider your opinions for once. Monica was clearly taken aback by Natsuki's words. That's not true at all. I'm sure you and Power Milk want to be more, or er, want to get more members too, right? I don't know what about oh, Yuri, but I was kind of indifferent. I, if I shown as much enthusiasm as Monica wanted, then I would probably be lying. Still, if it was up to me to rescue this situation, um, no. Natsuki's right, isn't she? This club. It's nothing more than a place for a few people to hang out. This is new text, by the way. Why did I think that everyone here saw that the same way I did? It's, yeah. But it doesn't 
uh, mean that I wasn't getting into new members and anything? Powder Milk, why did you even join this club? Why were you hoping to get out of it? Well, it's not really something I can be honest about, is it? In fact, if I remember, you weren't even giving a choice not uh, to join. Monica sits down and stares at her desk. What's the point of all this, anyway? What's... What if... Uh, what if starting this club was a mistake? Now you're done it, Monatsuki. She's trying to be a drama queen. Wait. I just noticed something. When Monica said that, she wasn't, like, standing in the frame. I, like, never really noticed that before. Yeah. Yeah, but here's this, though. She, she's try. I think she's trying to be a drama queen and make it about her. Yeah. What, what, me? I just spoke my mind. Is it a crime to be honest? It's not about being honest. It's about word choice. Besides, you have no right to speak for everyone else in this club like that. You don't stand at all. I just, I just want this place to feel a little nice to hang out with new friends. Is there a problem with the club being that for me? There aren't. There aren't, there aren't many other places like that for me. And now Monica wants to take it all away from me. She's not, she's not talking, she's not taking anything away. No, Powder Milk, it's not the same. It won't be the same in the direction she wants to take it. If you want, if I wanted that, then I could have joined any other stupid club. But this one, I mean, at least for a little bit of time, things were nice. That's when she starts picking, packing up her things. I'm going home. I feel like I don't belong here right now. Oh, Not this year. I've never ever had this happen. Wow, oh, this is new. Yeah, this is completely new. Natsuki ignores Yuri and walks right into the classroom. Mm, this is bad. I don't know what to do. Well, do you have an opinion for the festival? I don't know. It's kind of, I'm kind of indifferent, I guess. Whoa. Who cares about uh, that obnoxious brat? I mean, I like it nice and quiet in this club right now, and I'm just happy with, with you here. But still, I'm the vice president. That's not right for me to ignore my responsibilities like that. Nobody would cry if, it, if she killed herself. Oh, there's the eye bleeding part. Yep. You should do my best to consider everyone's perspective of making decision that's right for the club. What about you, Powder Milk? Would you want to get out of this club? Yuri repeats the same question as Monica. I decided to give the indirect answer than better than anything. I think the most important thing, is everyone, important thing is for everyone to get along. And the club provides something that you can get anywhere else. I don't think it is about me how many members, but rather the quantity, but rather the quality of each member. That's what I will end up making the literature club a special place. I see. You really agree with me. I really agree with you. Each member contributes their own qualities in a special way. With each change of uh, members identically, the club as a whole will change. I'm sorry, I thought I saw her face twitching for a minute. No, look at her face. <gasps> I saw, I knew I saw some changing. Whole, uh, will change too. No. I don't think that's necessarily a bad thing. Step out of your comfort zone once in a while. Step, she would be like Monica in the festival. I'm on your side as well. All right. Well, maybe we can talk to Natsuki tomorrow. Yuri nods. Hey, Yuri. Hey. Um, I know things were a little awkward yesterday, but I feel like you deserve to know that I still think that you're a wonderful vice president. And also, you're a wonderful friend. M Monica, I want to do everything I can to make the best club ever. Okay? Me too. Yeah. Let's go all go home for today. We'll talk about the festival tomorrow. Okay. I look forward to it. Shall we go, Powder Milk? Um, please don't take this the wrong way, but I'm going to chat add a little bit with Powder Milk we leave. Just so just to see what he thinks of the time here and all that. It's important to me as pri as president. Y Yuri looks at the little trouble, but she doesn't protest. Okay. I'll trust your judgment, Monica. In that case, I'll see you two tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Monica waves at Yuri as exists in the cla exits the classroom. Pew! Things have been a little he he Let me read. I, I I know. P H makes F sound. I know, but I, that's how I read it. Just let me read it. <laughs> Things have been a little he hectic lately, haven't they? 
Powdermilk, I just wanted to make sure you're enjoying time in this club. I would really hate this to see you uh, unhappy. I, I'm just going to say my name is Powder. I feel like you're kind of responsible as a president. What's going on? And I really do care about you, you know. I don't like seeing the other girls give you a hard time. With how mean Natsuki is and everything. And Yuri's a little bit, you know. <laughs> Sometimes I feel like you and I are complete, only real people here. You're not real. You know what I mean? Yeah, we all get what you mean, but you're not real. But it's weird, because all the time you, you have been here, we've been hardly gotten to spend any time together. Uh, I mean, I guess it's technically only been a couple days. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to say it is something weird. There's something I've been hoping to talk to you about. Things I know only you could understand. So that's why... Wait, not yet. No, no, no! She's trying to spend time with you. I know, but the game's not letting her. Yeah. I kind of feel bad for her Oh no. Damn it. Wait, Joy was supposed to be hurt. Look what's happening. Oh god. Oh wait, I have that one. Look. I wait. can't find a word that matches her. Is that true? Okay, there it goes. Sing. Okay. Boop. What was that? Siori! Wait, that was Siori? No, wait, that looked like Monica for a minute. Here, I'll look and see. Okay, you click on something. I'll look at the bottom. It's Monica! It's Monica! Yeah. She's trying to get out. Oh! Right in the... Uh-huh. Ha! Monica! She's trying to get out. Yeah, She's trying to take over. Okay, we're done. Hi, Powder Milk. I don't trust those eyes. Those eyes look very crazy. I've been waiting for you. Are you ready to continue reading? I brought my best tea today. Monica, I told you not to... Huh? Is she really late again? I'm considerable as usual, Natsuki. Excuse me? Must we interrupt my conversation with the, uh, with the, your insolent and yelling? What are you talking about? You say that like I do it on a regular basis or something. I was just, I wasn't paying attention, okay? I'm sorry. Seriously, what's going on in you lately? Look, I did some um, inking about yesterday, and I was a little bit more hostile than I meant to be. I guess I really felt threatened or something, but I know this is something you're, you were doing, you were doing together. Er, another, another new member wouldn't hurt as long as they're, they're cool. I guess another girl would be nice this time. So, Natsuki? Nobody cares. Why don't you go look for some coins under the vending machine or something? Oh man. I'm the last one here again. I can't believe she just said that in the game, and she actually recognized it. And she was crying when she left. Are you practicing piano again? Yeah. Uh-huh. You must have a lot of determination starting the club and make piano. Uh, man, this game is freaking me out. Determination. It's trying to push Natsuki away. Yeah, it's trying to make you go towards your I hate that. This is the passion. It's my, it made me to work in festival too, and anyway, powder milk. Oh, 
Uh, what do you want to do today? I guess I'm thinking we could... We already have plans today. Is that so, Yuri? That's correct. Powder Milk is already engaged in a novel that we're reading together. God, that face! Yeah. I suppose. Yeah, but until she kills everybody off, I'm assuming. Actually, it doesn't matter. It really doesn't. You guys do whatever you want. Yeah. Actually, I have a request. Do you mind if I make some tea first? Not at all. Uh, stands up and makes her way to the closet. For a watch so she reverts a small water pitcher from the shelf, a kind of a little. <coughs> Sir, <coughs> could you get me some water, please? Here, you could you fill this up? Could you fill this up with water? Here, I'll pause the recording for now. Okay, I I, I watch as she retrieves a small pitcher of pitcher from the shelf, the kind of with a filter inside. Can you hold on, hold this for a second? Sure. Mary hands me a water pitcher and also fetches an electric kettle. Plug it in the room, some water, pass the kettle on the teacher's desk. I simply watch her movements. She's surprised, she moves with really contrast with speaking mannerisms. Your hands, you not the water bowl? Okay. Okay, go back. That's okay. You stay here, I won't take long. Okay. Uh, did you, Yuri, leave you again? No, it's not like that this time. The first time you went with her, uh, she's just filling up the water pitcher to make tea. Oh, okay. Sorry for misunderstanding. Ten minutes passed. Yuri said she would, didn't take long. I was holding her up. I ju I'm bored just waiting here, so I decided to go look for her. Let's see. The most logical place Yuri would be the nearest water fountain. I started heading down the alley. <laughs> What's that noise? Oh no. It's coming from around the corner. It sounds like breathing. <sighs> A sharp inhale, like someone is sucking the air through their teeth. Are they in pain? I reach the teeth to peer around it. Yuri? Yeah. Yeah, it's skipping through shit. What the fuck? I'm back. Thanks for waiting patiently. Powder, do you like my oolong tea? History? Uh, yeah. Look, it's all glitched too. Oh wait, that's just because my name is long. Never mind. Uh, oh uh, yeah. Anything is fine. Very well. Yuri sets the temperature of the kettle for 200 degrees. Oh, and the teapot. Yeah. Of course, I should do is any less than always making tea for others. Uh, uh, mm. Those chips smell good. No, thank you. I don't like. It's not spicy. No, 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 no. no, it's not that they're spicy. It's just I don't want any. Try one. I'm on recording. I can't have. I can't eat and record. The chip was delicious. Anyway. In that case, you'll only be even more impressed. Or, perhaps I will. Mary fetches the teapot and begins measuring the tea leaves. That's why she even starts humming to herself a little. Uh, uh, uh -huh, uh -huh. That means uh, Natsuki's not gonna be here. I don't even know if I can keep up with this. I'm here is pouring a cup of tea for each of us. I have other requests. Do you mind if we sit on the floor today? Mm. Mm. She was about to say her boobs. Um. Uh -huh. It's all the same stuff. The chocolate thing. I don't like the sounds of this. Uh, 
She's wearing a tense reading expression. Mm -hmm. So he will take any insurance. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's this. I remember this from before. Yuri opens the book with both hands. She holds that she's hard to read from it. And in that case, Yuri's totally focused on reading again. I'll make a chocolate candy and pop it in my mouth. Then I'll take another chocolate and hold it to Yuri's. She doesn't even look away from the book. She simply parts her lips. It's pretty natural. And there's the chocolate thing again. And... It stopped. The music stopped. He starts to breathe heavy. I can't. Powder milk. Suddenly, Yuri for forcibly grabs my arm and jerks me to my feet. My teacup gets knocked over. Powder milk. My heart. My heart won't stop pounding. Powder milk. I can't calm down. That focus of anything more. This is new. This is new for me. Yeah, it is new. Can you feel it, Powder milk? Yuri suddenly pr presses my hand against her chest. Why is this happening to me? I can feel me. I can't. I can. Fe I feel like I'm losing my mind. I can't make it stop. It even makes me want to, not to want to read. I just want to look at you. Oh God! Look at the eyes. I know. <laughs> no, they're like real. I know. I saw that. Uh, that or they just drawn weird. Uh, Um, is it time to share po- it's time to share poems! Thank you, Monica, for saving me. Yeah. Yeah. I think I saw something that earlier you weren't supposed to see. I think you saw something you weren't earlier you weren't supposed to see. I don't want you to have to tell you this, but I think you have no choice. It's getting kind of dangerous to spend so much time with you, Uri. I don't know why, but it seems pretty ex easily excitable when she's around you. Which is supposed to be a problem itself. But when Yuri gets too excited, she finds a place to hide and starts cutting herself in the pot with a pocket knife. Is that kind of messed up? Okay then! This is all new dialogue! Why are you staring at me? Don't. <laughs> I'm bringing a different at school and she was uh, collecting or something. I mean, it's different, it's different because she's d depressed or anything. It's like that. I think it's because she kind of gets high from it. So she has a she's masochist. She's a masochist. I I'm, it might be even be like a sexual thing. But at this point I have kind of been enabling her. I'm not saying it's your fault though. But I guess it's why I had to explain it all to you. So I think it's kind of just keep your distance and probably the best for her. While you're at it, don't be shy to spend a little more time with me. Put it slightly, at least you, it's your time in your head. I know how to treat the club members. Anyway, I worked really, really hard on this poem, so I hope you like it effective. Here he goes. Jeez, it's that really startled me. Um, well, I guess I kind of messed up at uh, writing this poem. I was just trying to. Never mind. Let's just move on. So she didn't get to read mine, I didn't get to read her, hers, and nothing changed there. Nothing in the back. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh Natsuki's poem. I know about this part. This is the one, right? Alright. Yeah. Alright, yesterday I uh, uh, okay. I mean, I know I'm pre I'm not president or vice president or anything, but it doesn't mean you'll let me down, okay? No, no, no. Okay, we clear this poem. Wait, what? It just. Oh. Did you put it out? No. They just kind of minimized for a minute. I don't know what else is to bring this up, but there's been something I've been worried about. Yuri has been acting kind of strange lately. You've only been here for a few days, so you're not only mean, but she's normally like this. She's always been quiet, quiet. 
and I'm all attentive and things like that. Hey, embarrassing, but the truth is, I'm really worried about her. I'm really talking to her. She's just mad at me again. I don't know what to do. I think you're the only person that lis she's listening to. I don't know. I'm reading fast because I'm afraid it's just going to go away. But please try to do something. Maybe you can convince her to talk to a therapist. I'm o always wanted to try to bring my best friends, but... In a minute, but please, if you do something to help, I don't know anything bad happened to her. I'll make cupcakes if I have to. Just please try to do something. As for Monica, I don't know why, but she's been really dismissive about this. It's like she just wants us to ignore it. So I'm mad at her right now, and that's why I'm coming to you about this. Don't let her know I wrote this. Just pretend like I gave you a really good poem, okay? I'm counting on you. Thanks for reading. When's she gonna get Monica? I bet she wrote a backup. I changed my mind. Ignore everything you just read. There is a mic. Monica knows. But Monica couldn't get to what you were reading first. Monica yeah. doesn't want you to worry and do anything. I'm, wor I'm worrying. There's no <laughs> point in trying to do anything. It's your own fault that she is so unlikable. Can you hear me, Powder Milk? I'm pausing. Anyway, wait, what? That, that sounds completely out of context now that it started recording. Because it started when you said, drink my Barty wash. <laughs> Can you hear me in a powdered milk? If you want to just spend more time with Monica, all these problems would go away. Yuri and I are so too messed up for someone who's as wonderful as you. Just think of Monica from now on. Just Monica. Just Monica. Just Monica. When I ignored Yuri, that happened. I know. What? Okay, we're back to normal. Nothing changed over there. There's nothing in the background changed. Okay, they're still there. Yeah, nothing changed. I know there's nothing changed. It's all the same stuff. Finally. <laughs> she holds up her poem to her face and make, takes a deep breath. I love it. I love everything about it. Powder milk, I want to take this home. Will let me keep it, please? Sure, I don't care. <laughs> she doesn't even read it. She's just like... <laughs> she's like... No, this is what she's like. Takes the poem and goes... <laughs> oh, it yeah. smells like my senpai. No, Power Milk, I, I, anyone nice as you, I could die. Not not really, but I just want to, you know to how to describe it. I only want to feel this way, right? It's not bad, right? Yuri holds up the poem to her chest. I'm going to take this home and keep it in my room and masturbate to it. Yeah. Uh, I hope that is what makes you feel good when I, I think of you about having it. Take good care of it. I'll even touch myself while reading it over and over. I called it. I'll give you myself paper cuts so oh, your skin oh enters my bloodstream. No, I'll be honest. This light here, I accidentally saw on pay Facebook. Really? Just that, just those, just that text with her face on it. Okay. Just the text, not this particular scene. Just the text. <laughs> those eyes. Can you? Ha you can have my poem too. Besides, after you read it, I'll go to my... Oh, really? You're really going to want to keep it. Here, take it. I can't wait any longer. Here, read it. This... This isn't another language. It looks like it's Japanese. Do you like it? I wrote it for you. In that case, you could tell the poem. Um, it's about. <laughs> More importantly, I know it in my own with my own scent. See, you're not a useful person. I'm getting. What the fuck? Uh, I, I think I'm going to vomit. What? It just says yes and no. Can you hear me?
There was a laugh in the background of that. Okay, everyone. It's time for to figure out the festival preparations. Let's hurry up over this. Mm -hmm. Foreshadowing of something terrible is about... Digitally, the air is coming. Foreshadowing about something terrible is about to happen. Look, we came to the dawn. Mm -hmm. Cupcakes. And, uh, this time I'm gonna go to Notsuki's house because I already did the thing with her. Here you can. Well, it doesn't matter. What? As long as it will help. Monica, I'm not useless, you know. Oh, she says she's not useless this time. Because before she said she was useless. Uh, I know that. I already know oh, what it's like. It's like they switched places. No, no. I know, but. Yeah, her hands were bloody. Because, huh? I don't know, it seems like she's trying to fight no, something. you remember? Huh? You remember what we talked about? Not exactly. I don't understand... <laughs> I don't understand why her hands are bloody. Explain that to me. Not right now, I'm just going. Uh, we just talked about it. I know, but you said it had something to do with Monica doing something. But I don't understand what the hell has to do with her hands. I already know what I'd like to do. We can run a successful poetry event, but even though we have the right atmosphere and location, so when the decoration set, the mood and lighting. There, see? That's a great idea. I already give you something to do. Uh, what about powder milk? Powder milk is going to help me. Wait, you? Easiest job, huh? Sure, but it, but that's how just how it is. Like hell it is. What are you going to try to pull? I agree with Natsuki. I don't know that. I benefit an extra pair of hands. Mine too. What, your cupcakes? Please. Like you would fucking know. All I care about is dra all you care about is dragging powder milk around you and on your stupid books. And you, Monica, you and Monica. Hey, I didn't even do that. Okay, then why you let powder milk decide who he wants to instead of abusing your power? I'm not abusing my power. Yes, you are, Monica. Just tell powder milk to make a choice, okay? Please let me make a choice. Fine, fine. Jeez. Uh, I'll have seen you two right now. Region just... Natsuki, just shut your fucking mouth and let me decide for himself. You shut your mouth. Jesus Christ. Man, this, this, this is getting darker. This is never going to end. Just make a choice, okay? It won't... Oh, no! Yeah. Well, you play. I try to click it fast click it. It's all Monica. Stop with the eyes! Why is it Yuri's eyes though? I don't know. I'm just gonna go click Monica. You picked me. Uh, this is Rika. I'm not gonna lie. This is not fair. No, I don't like Monica. To do. I didn't even get you any work. You decided it for yourself. You're being a little unreasonable here. I'm being unreasonable. Uh, Monica, I can't believe how delusional and self-important you are. Her eyes right now. Pulling powder milk away from me like every single time you're not including included in something. Are you jealous? Crazy? Or maybe you just hate yourself so much that you take it out on others. Here's a suggestion. Have you considered killing yourself? Would you benefit of the mental health? Yuri, you're scaring me a little. Natsuki, let's just go. I don't think she wants to us around right now. You see, that wasn't very hard. All I wanted to do was spend a little time with him. Is that much so much to ask? Yuri he follows Monica and uh, Natsuki to the door. Hey, powder milk. Yuri is re really something, isn't she? Monica giggles as Yuri pushes her out, out the door. Finally. Oh, this <gasps> This part, Derek, this part. There's a poem! Something came up! Have a nice weekend, it says. It's a file I can't open! Yeah, it is. But it won't let me open it. What stuff? Notepad? 
There is no Internet Explorer. Oh, oh, here we go. Sorry. You can hear the heavy breathing in the game. Uh, don't recommend, okay? What is all this? Okay, that's a code we can probably look at later. Finally! This is the, really all I wanted. Powder milk, there's no need to spend the weekend with Monica. Don't listen to her. Just come to my house instead. Oh! Enjoy your weekend! Okay, remember that, okay? Your weekend. Two days. Okay. okay? That wasn't Yuri, by the way. That was one who's speaking. I know this now. I remember it now. Uh-huh. Something big is gonna come up. You are going to scream. Okay? okay. Two of us? Doesn't that sound wonderful? <laughs> wow, there's really so Yeah, like how I don't even get to talk anymore. Something wrong with me isn't there, but you know what? I don't care anymore. I never felt this good in my whole life. I just being with you is far greater pleasure than anything I could imagine. I'm addicted to you. It feels like I'm going to die if I don't, if I'm not breathing the same air as you. Doesn't it feel like nice to have someone care about you so much? She just changed. You have something I wanted to resolve all the entire life around you, but it feels so good. But then go, oh, does this feel more and more like something horrible is going to happen? Maybe that's why I tried to stop. I tried stopping myself at first, but I feel it's too strong now. I don't care anymore, powdered milk. I have to tell you, I'm madly in love with you. I feel like everything inch of my body, every drop of my blood, is screaming your name. I don't care what the consequences are anymore. I don't care what if Monica is listening. Please, powdered milk, just know how much I love you. Hold on, I'm just gonna highlight it, just to be sure. For myself, my pen, and I stole- I love you so much that I even touched myself with the pen I stole from you. I just wanted to pull your skin open and crawl inside of you. Oh. Oh. I want you all to myself, and I will only be yours. Doesn't that sound perfect? Tell me, powdered milk. You tell me what you want to be- you want to be my lover. Do you accept my confession? I'm gonna say no, okay? Okay, because I only know the yes route. Ahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahahah
wish it would just let me go to the end of it. Okay, guys, I'm going to have to hold on for a little bit, okay, guys? I'll catch you guys in the next episode, and um, we'll continue this when we uh, finish it, okay? So I'll be right back. I'm going to save. And... But it helps me get back to where I was. So, anyway... Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of whatever the fuck just happened here. I'll catch you guys later. Stay nerdy, my friends. Bye!